Hi friends, welcome to my channel. My name is Stephanie and today I'm making roasted red pepper soup. This is Ginger Snap Kitchen. The first thing I did was take four red bell peppers, cut them in half, then remove the membranes and seeds. Then I placed them on a foil lined baking sheet, cut side down. I added a few garlic cloves. Then I put the pan under the broiler for about 15 minutes. This is how they looked after that. I carefully removed them from the pan and placed them in a container with a lid. This allows them to get steamy and makes it easier to remove the skins. While I waited for them to get cool enough to handle, I added about two tablespoons of olive oil to my Dutch oven, along with a medium-sized onion that was coarsely chopped. I sauteed the onion for about 15 minutes until it was translucent and soft. Once the peppers had cooled, I removed the blackened skin. After that, I added the roasted peppers to my food processor, along with the sauteed onions and the roasted garlic cloves. Then I allowed them to process for about five minutes until the mixture was mostly smooth. Once the mixture was smooth, I transferred it to my Dutch oven. I added four cups of vegetable broth, a few dashes of my favorite hot sauce, about half a teaspoon of black pepper, and a quarter teaspoon of kosher salt. Then I stirred everything together and brought the mixture to a boil. Once it came to a boil, I gave it a stir, reduced the heat to low, and covered it. Then I allowed it to simmer with the cover on for about 15 minutes. After 15 minutes, I removed the cover, then removed it from the heat. Then I added a teaspoon of crushed dried oregano. After that, it was ready to serve. It's delicious, topped with any fresh herbs you like. Or how about some dairy-free sour cream? Regular sour cream or Greek yogurt are also nice. No matter what you decide to put on top, it's definitely worth trying. I'm always happy to find new ways to add vegetables to my diet. Thank you for stopping by to check out this recipe. I hope you'll join me again soon. I upload something new and delicious twice a week. All right. See you next time.